Chapter 24, Part 2 The Scorpion Sting Satya greeted his parents with an unrestricted outpouring of Vedantic philosophy. Confused and distressed, they observed the strange events. One day, Satya commanded the men to call Narayana Shastri the learned pundit. He said, he is misinterpreting the Bhagavatam. He is to be corrected straight away. The pundit was very knowledgeable and recited the Bhagavatam, a sacred text, to the people. Strangely enough, Satya knew what errors the learned man was making. When the pundit was told, he grew very angry and yelled, How dare he! He stormed into Satya's room. When Satya saw him, he started explaining the most complex passages from the scripture in the most simple and lucid language. The pundit prostrated at the feet of Satya and begged for forgiveness, saying, Satya is a Vedic scholar true to his knowledge, the Great One. A tantric, worshipper of Mother Deity, was summoned by the Raju family out of desperation. Satya looked at him and said authoritatively, I am everything, in everything, you can do nothing, go. He quietly dashed out of the house, telling Seshama Raju, he isn't possessed, he is simply divine. The family was having a hard time believing all this, they called an exorcist. The exorcist saw Satya and ran away. He lost the courage to even go near the entity he had never experienced before. At last, they took Satya to a Muslim man who gave a long list of items to be procured for the procedure. Satya cornered the man and named an item that he had forgotten to mention. He is not possessed, he is the Great One. The man refused to do anything with the boy and left. 